Today I would say in the Old Testament a long life was important. You know, a long life. But in the New Testament, quantity is never emphasized. Not number of people in a church, but the quality of a church. Not how long you live, but the quality of your life. Jesus lived 33 years. The Apostle James lived about 30 years and he was beheaded. Stephen, probably 28, 29 years, stoned to death. Many great men and women did not live long lives. Many of them were martyred as young people. Quality of their life. But they were faithful. So don't think of long life as an important thing, but being faithful to Jesus until the end. I never forget the story I heard of a missionary in Africa who told me this story. That when Christianity first went to, I think it was Kenya, uh, nowadays a lot of Christians there, but in the early days, <laughs> they were spirit worshippers in that tribe called the Kikuyu tribe. And when the missionaries went there, and the first Christian, first person from that tribe was converted, he and his little 12-year-old son. And the whole tribe was upset, and the chief ordered a, a conference. Conference means a discussion of the tribe, and they brought this father and son who dared to accept a religion called Christianity, which all their fathers had never accepted. And they asked this man, will you renounce Christ? Imagine, just newly converted. He said, no. Jesus is my savior. And the chief said, I'll kill you. He said, fine. Got somebody to take a sword and cut off his head. Right there, in the presence of everybody on this platform. And they called the little boy. What about you? See what I did to your father? Are you going to renounce Christ? And he said, no. Christ is my savior too. Twelve years old. But he said, before you cut off my head, let me take off my shirt. And he took off his shirt. And he said, before this gets stained with my blood, I want to give it to you. Give it to your son. And always remember that I loved you even though you killed me. We're going to meet some people like this in eternity who are faithful. They didn't live long lives, but they were faithful. 